Even though, Pravit, you are the lucky man and you are the luckier one, I would say that I'm very blessed that you came into my life and you changed me for the better in a positive way. And now I, I can't imagine my life without you. And I can't wait to start a life with you, start a family with you, and build something really great. Because I think the two of us are already great as individuals. But when we put the two of us together, we're going to be even greater. Uh, my name is Prawit Rojanaprit. Well, before we met, um, I uh, was told by uh, her uncle, Vanina's uncle, Somtao Sujarit Gun, who is a well-known um, conductor, that um, her, uh, his mother, um, Thai Tao Sujarit Gun, or Vanina's grandmother, Somtao said it's quite difficult to find someone of her caliber, uh, particularly a Thai, who wouldn't be uh, intimidated by her. And so eventually we met uh, at a restaurant uh, somewhere on Sukhumwit. What I like about him is he has pretty much all the qualities that I have been looking for. I wanted to meet somebody who is multilingual, who has lived in many countries, because for me, I, am, I have three citizenships. I'm Thai, I'm French, I'm American. I've lived in France, in Thailand, in the US, in Hong Kong, in the Netherlands. So I connect most with somebody who's lived around the world and who speaks more than one language, yet is also Thai and has a Thai culture, background and manners. And Pravit and I are very similar in that way. And um, he's somebody with a very kind and gentle heart. He's very kind, he's very sweet, and um, he loves my pets, which is very important. Well, she's very intelligent, a very sweet person, and I, I think she knows what she wants. So she could be very frank, uh, direct, sometimes even too direct, but I think that's a good sign. Uh, a very uh, lovely person, and she really loves um, fr her friends as well as um, her pets. Um, Roxy and uh, Shiloh, which has a small little dog and a cat uh, back in Paris. So when he came to Paris, he absolutely fell in love with my pets, which was great for me. Although, Bravid started spoiling my pets a little bit too much. So when we would have lunch or dinner, he would start feeding them. And all of a sudden, they would bother us while we were eating. Whereas I always disciplined my pets not to eat or bother us while we're having dinner. So I would tell him, yeah, <laughs> and um, other things like my cat loves taro, which is this fish snacks for people. So he would buy, he would come with a suitcase full of taro, but like the spicy kind, which my cat cannot eat, but he would always overfeed them. So I think because he likes, he loves them so much, he wants to spoil them, like spoiling kids. So I basically have to, you know, tell Pravit to have a little bit of a limit with my pets, otherwise they're going to get very fat. Well, uh, you know, the actual day uh, took place in Huahin. So we prepared, it wasn't a total surprise, but uh, we agreed that it should take place somewhere nice. So we went to Hua Hin and I did kneel down on the beach uh, that was at the Intercontinental uh, Resort uh, in Hua Hin. Um, uh, only a very small group of friends, um, uh, particularly Vanina's friends uh, were there. So we had a long table of about 12 people on the beach. Uh, next to the sea, and uh, it was uh, uh, the twilight was about uh, the sun was setting, and uh, it was twilight time, so it was a very memorable. Brevet came out with the servers. I, I think he had many different plans. He thought of 
being the guy at the receptionist taking my luggage. I think he had many different plans as to how he would, but um, as to how he would surprise me within the plan proposal. But he came out with the servers holding a plate and he gave a, a very moving speech with, you know, completely got me into tears where he talked about, you know, when he met me, he, he didn't quite know what to do, but letting me go was not on the list or was not an option. And um, that was very touching. And he got on his knees and opened the soup plate, which was a ring. And um, the rest was history, then we got engaged and Yes, it was a beautiful night and very memorable. I can only thank her. She pushed me to become a better person in many ways, to get a driver license, to get into shape, you know, do the work out and eat clean food. And I, I think that has been very beneficial. I hope to return the favor in the years and decades to come. So I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to have met her. To love